Ever wondered about the secrets to becoming rich? There are 10 eye-opening secrets that can lead you to a wealthier life. From creating your own luck to understanding the rules of money, these secrets can transform your financial perspective. Let's explore these secrets together, shall we? The first secret is to create your own luck. Now, you might be thinking, isn't luck something that just happens? Well, not exactly. In the world of money, luck is often a byproduct of action. It's about creating opportunities and making the most out of every situation. Imagine being a miner, sifting through dirt and stones. The more you sift, the higher your chances of finding a gem. That's how creating your own luck works. You dig into opportunities, learn new skills, meet new people and step outside your comfort zone. And when the gem of an opportunity does come along, you're ready to seize it. Every interaction, every decision, every risk taken, they all contribute to creating your own luck. It's all about being proactive, not reactive. So don't wait for luck to find you. Go out there and create it. Remember, you're the master of your destiny. Secret number two, don't live below your means. You might have heard the age-old wisdom, live within your means. But what if I told you there's another layer to that? Here's the twist. Don't unnecessarily restrain yourself to a frugal lifestyle. It doesn't mean splurging recklessly, but rather finding a balance. You see, the concept of living below your means often gets misconstrued as living frugally. But in reality, it's about making smart financial decisions that allow you to enjoy the fruits of your labor without falling into debt. It's about creating a lifestyle that is sustainable and enjoyable, while also building a secure financial future. So don't shy away from that occasional treat or indulgence, but make sure you're not sacrificing your financial stability. Remember, life is not just about surviving, it's about thriving. So invest in experiences, cultivate your passions, and enjoy your hard-earned money. But do it wisely. Live life to its fullest, but wisely. The third secret, understand the rules of money before aiming to win. Picture this, you're entering a chess tournament, but you've never played the game before. Without knowing the rules, the strategies, the moves, you're likely to lose. The same goes for the game of money. Having a solid understanding of how money works is like knowing the rules of the game. It's about understanding that money isn't just something you earn and spend. It's a tool that can be invested to create more wealth. It's about knowing the difference between assets and liabilities, and how to leverage each to your advantage. It's about grasping the concept of compound interest, and how it can work for you or against you. It's about understanding risk and reward, and how to balance the two. It's about knowing that financial planning isn't just for the wealthy, but for everyone who wants to win the money game. Know the game before you play it. Secret number four, think big. Now let's take a moment to ponder on this. What does thinking big really mean? It's not about daydreaming or wishful thinking. No, it's about having substantial goals, audacious dreams that push your boundaries and make you step out of your comfort zone. You see, when you think big, you invite big opportunities. You open doors to possibilities that can lead to greater wealth and prosperity. It's like setting sail on a vast ocean. The larger your ship, the more cargo it can carry. Similarly, the bigger your dreams, the more wealth they can bring. But remember, a large ship also needs a skilled captain to steer it. So, equip yourself with knowledge, skills, and resilience to navigate the ocean of opportunities. In essence, don't limit your dreams to your current circumstances. Dream big, work hard, and let your dreams guide you to your destiny. Your dreams define your destiny. The fifth secret, ask yourself, what's the worst that can happen? Fear can be a paralyzing force, stopping us from taking risks and making bold money moves. But here's the secret. Wealth rarely comes from playing it safe. The greatest fortunes have been built on calculated risks. So when you're faced with a financial decision, confront your fears and ask yourself, what's the worst that can happen? If you invest in a startup and it fails, will you be left penniless? If you buy that property and the market crashes, will you still have a roof over your head? Once you've identified the worst case scenario, you can take steps to mitigate those risks. Remember, failure isn't fatal. It's merely a stepping stone on the path to success. So embrace the risk, conquer your fears and let your money work for you. Because in the end, there's a universal truth. No risk, no reward. The sixth secret, understand that money is the game. Money, my friends, is not merely a piece of paper or a number in your bank account. It's a tool, a means to an end, the key player in the game of life. Just as in any game, you need to understand the rules, strategies, and players to win. 
Imagine the game of chess where each piece has its role, its strengths and weaknesses. Money is like the queen on this chessboard, the most powerful piece able to move any number of squares along any direction. It's the piece that can change the game. Understanding money as a tool means recognizing its power and potential. It means leveraging it wisely to create wealth, to build businesses, to invest in assets, and to secure your financial future. It's not about hoarding money, it's about using it effectively. It's about making smart, informed decisions that allow your money to work for you. So remember, play the game, don't let the game play you. The seventh secret, beware of the sunk cost fallacy. This is a mental trap we often fall into when we've invested time, money, or effort into something. We feel obliged to continue, even if it's not in our best interest, just because we've already spent resources on it. It's like buying a movie ticket and realizing halfway through that the movie is terrible, but sitting through the rest anyway because you've already paid for it. That's the sunk cost fallacy in action. In financial decisions, it's crucial to be aware of this fallacy. It's easy to keep pouring money into a failing business or bad investment just because you've already invested so much. But remember, money spent is gone. It's sunk. It shouldn't influence your present and future decisions. What matters is what you stand to gain or lose from this point forward. Evaluate your choices based on their future value, not past costs. Don't let past mistakes dictate your future decisions. The eighth secret? Aim to get rich young. Now this doesn't mean you should be a millionaire by the time you're 20. What it means is to start your journey to wealth early in life. Why? Because time is a powerful ally. Consider the magic of compound interest. If you start saving and investing in your early 20s, by the time you're in your 50s, you'll have a significant nest egg. But if you wait until your 30s or 40s to start, you'll have much less time to grow your wealth. Furthermore, starting young gives you the freedom to take calculated risks. If a venture fails, you have time to recover and try again. It also allows you to experiment, learn, and grow in your understanding of money and wealth creation. In essence, getting rich young isn't about instant wealth. It's about starting the journey early, making smart decisions, and allowing time to do its work. The earlier you start, the better. The ninth secret, the balance between spending, saving, and investing. This trinity of financial management is the cornerstone of wealth creation. Spending is necessary, of course, we all have bills to pay and lives to live, but unchecked spending can lead to financial ruin. That's where saving comes in. By setting aside a portion of your income, you create a safety net for yourself. But remember, saving alone isn't enough. Money saved is money that's not growing. That's why investing is the third pillar in this financial triumvirate. By investing, you put your money to work for you, generating more wealth over time. But beware, investing without knowledge is akin to sailing without a compass. It's crucial to invest wisely and diversely to mitigate risk. The balance of these three, spending, saving, and investing, is not a one-size-fits-all formula. It requires continuous tweaking and fine-tuning based on your financial goals and circumstances. Balance is the key to financial success. The tenth and final secret, buy assets, not liabilities. Let's decode that. An asset is something that puts money in your pocket. A liability is something that takes money out of your pocket. See the difference? Now think about this. You buy a fancy car. It looks great, but it's rapidly depreciating in value. That's a liability. On the other hand, you invest in a rental property. The property appreciates over time, and the rent you collect is additional income. That's an asset. We're not saying don't buy that car. But consider this. If your assets can pay for your liabilities, you're on the path to financial freedom. It's simple. Focus on buying income-generating assets. These could be stocks, real estate, or a part of a profitable business. Remember, your goal is to have your money work for you, not the other way around. Invest in assets, they're your ticket to wealth. Now that we've unveiled the 10 secrets to becoming rich, let's have a quick recap. First, create your own luck and don't wait for it to knock on your door. Second, don't live below your means, instead aim to expand them. Third, understand the rules of money before you aim to win. Fourth, think big and don't limit your ambitions. Fifth, what's the worst that can happen? Understand your risk tolerance. Sixth, money is the game, so play it well. Seventh, beware of the sunk cost fallacy. 8th, strive to get rich young and enjoy it. 9th, master the art of spending, saving and investing. 10th, buy assets and let them work for you. Remember becoming rich is a journey not a destination. Happy journeying!